Hello, Soul Healers, and welcome now to Wednesday. Well, it's going to be a sunny and productive day today for the virgins of the zodiac, the Virgos. The moon is actually in two signs, and the sun today is ruled by Saturn. Let's start with the sun. Now, we're in Chapter 2 of Sun in Sagittarius. This month, Virgos are really stepping into a real, what I call, hmm, well, let's just say it this way. It is the potting soil of your soul garden. It is your flower pot. It is your foundation. It's your root chakra, if you know the chakras. It is your health. It is your survival. It is what guarantees you that you will go on. It's also your self-nurturing, and it's a spot where Virgos really did not feel strong for 12 solid years. I keep reminding you of this. So today we're in Chapter 2 of Sun in Sagittarius, and today Saturn's ruling the day, which means it's time to make a decision about how grounded you want to be. Now, I don't care what the details are, Virgo. I know you, Virgos, you're going to be like, oh, how can that ever happen? Your mind is going to want to just take away that vibration. But you've got to make a decision. Hey, I want to be able to provide for myself. I want to be able to survive without alimony. I want to be able to survive without having to work 90 hours a week and get two jobs. I want to survive and take care of myself and have enough time for sleep and have enough time for nurturing. This is what I want. And so today it's important to make a decision about what you want. Don't worry about how much your mind doubts. Don't worry about all the obstacles that are in the way of that. That's God Universe's job. You need to make a decision and be clear on your decision and we'll work on manifesting that in chapter three. Also, the moon. The moon starts in Virgo, so I think Virgos are feeling kind of happy-go-lucky for the first half of the day. It's technically sunny and cool with the moon in Virgo. Then the second half of the day, the moon moves into Libra and will cross Saturn. What that means for you is that you might have to grow up and mature just a little bit about what you're really worth, okay? Saturn in the second house, the house of soul capital, is saying to Virgos, in the next 18 months to almost two years, you're going to completely reinvent your self-esteem, how productive you are, and your ability to make money. But as the moon crosses Saturn here in these early stages, you might have to grow up just a little bit about your emotional expectations. So for instance, maybe you emotionally expect your parents to keep helping you, but you're like 29. Well, that's not very mature. That's not taking responsibility for your value. So look for a little area in your life today where your emotions are expecting something immature around money or self-esteem. Then lastly, Skip Jennings goes live today with a new episode of The Urban Mystic. Now he's going to help us with the word gratitude, which is incredibly important, by the way. Don't miss Skip. He's everywhere. The SG Inner Television Network does stream. All right, Virgo, that's all I have for Wednesday. I'll see you tomorrow with more. Live, love, be. So